On Tuesday, November 22nd, hundreds gathered to help light a tree along a prominent central Stockton street. This lighting meant a lot to people who were there, as many of the lights that lit up the tree symbolized the passing of a loved one. For Cedric Anderson and his family, this event reminded them of the Hospice of San Joaquin's mission. So with hospice assistance, with the assigned staff such as Soot, Josh, and others, it made it possible for me to keep her home. So I thank you for putting up with the decline of services and altering of schedules to accommodate the needs of my family. Because it wasn't easy dealing with a multiple individuals who were all trying to do what was in the best interest of my mother. And I thank you personally for assisting me with her meds and signs to look for along with the encouraging support because in her dad last days, I was lost. I didn't know what else to do and requested that she be placed in the hospice facility. Another star of the night's events was first grader Nev Giannini, who drew a painting that was featured on the front of this year's program. Please welcome the 2016 program cover artist Nevi Giannini with teacher Mrs. Paula Ross and principal Mary McCaffrey. Please come to the podium. If you will now look at the cover of tonight's program, you will see a wonderful holiday tree drawn by Nevi. Thank you, Mrs. Ross and Principal McCaffrey, and congratulations, Nevi, on your drawing of this terrific holiday tree. Five, four, three, two, one. Light the tree. The purpose of the tree lighting ceremony was to light up people's lives. The main, the purpose of the tree lighting ceremony is to light up a light and light up a life in honor or in memory of a loved one. And it is a way for us to help our families and help the community with their grieving process and being able to honor those For us. For SCW News, I'm Gabriel Porras.